Is George Janko dangerous? I think he he's he's dangerous. I don't think so. To uh, to a good portion of impressionable young baby Christians. I I don't think he's dangerous because if you actually care about his walk and with his life and what he's going through, you're going to see the progressive change that's going on through his life, right? Um, I know, for example, we take clips at certain times and we post stuff on there, but Manny and I, we try and watch a lot of the stuff that's going on so we get the full context of what's going on. And seeing George right now compared to me seeing him like, you know, four months ago, five months ago, it, it, there's a difference. You can see that although, yes, he's he may be open on some of the sin that he's doing, he's still open that, hey, I'm still trying to figure out this yeah. walk and I'm still going through it. So if anything, I feel like, and I commend him more of being so out there because, you know, there there is the perspective where there's the idea in churches where it's like, well, everybody's there is perfect, all these other things. So I actually think we can learn a lot from his openness especially to people who's been in the church for a long time. Yeah, I think that um, I still think that he's definitely dangerous for a certain amount of people. Um, I think that especially when you're when you are in a position of leadership, I think that you need to be a lot more mindful for sure. of how you carry yourself. For sure. Um, and if you don't know how to behave, then maybe you like for example if certain things in your life you're you are uh you know that you shouldn't be doing yes it's not that you're gonna put up a front right i'm not saying that at all but at the same time like as leaders you have to um and again like it's not his fault that he has followers right like people just like no, him. he started you know outside, people man. people are looking on to him and i mean it's just a cross at this point that he has he has to to carry and the thing is is that i want to be clear i enjoy and i love the fact that he is open but i want to have a conversation about this about yeah. how open should you be right as yeah. a christian right so what well, depends um, who you're talking to right like for example but wait wait, wait. before we get into that okay. uh, i just want to finish this thought is that Do it. um you know you are responsible for his whatever 2000 and something he's not responsible for everything that they do but i think that a lot of um what he shares who he is the discussions that he has to an extent people are going to take their cues from him like i'll give you an example what if somebody tunes in who's been following him right yeah and they only make it to the point where he talks about how he's still sleeping with his girl and he thinks it's fine because you know he's not sleeping with anybody else and then that maybe they fall off for like six months and they're like, yo, like this guy's a Christian. He's doing that. So then they now implement this into their life. Yet six months afterwards, he's talking about how, you know, he's um, been committed to uh, making her a fiance. They're not sleeping together anymore. Like all of these things. So, you know what I mean? Like you could have one last impression on somebody. You don't know when that could be. Yeah. And the example that you give and what you share could be dangerous to yeah, that person's life. That's that, what I'm saying. Though, I struggle with that because at the same point, right? Like, I'm not going to say everybody knows about the Bible, but yeah. a good majority of people, let's say here you know, in the United States, knows that having sex outside of marriage is a problem. So I also have a problem with being so worried on every little thing that you're trying to figure mm-hmm. out what you're doing when it's like, you know, to use an example like that, whoever just watches up to that point and says, all right, because George is having sex, that means I can have sex. Yeah. Well, he's a leader, right? He may be a leader, but just because you may have somebody that's a leader that's still learning in this case, mm-hmm. it still doesn't negate the fact that's already there that majority of people already know. 